and don't celebrate yet. The rains will only be here for three more days, Met Department says. And our sign language interpreter tonight is Meresha Owiti. Let's begin with Nairobi County Governor Dr. Evans Kidero appeared before the Senate County Public Accounts and Investments Committee to explain why the county government transferred 11 billion shillings from the exchequer to commercial banks without approval from the controller of budget. The governor was also put to task to explain why some of the money the county collects is not banked in the county revenue fund account. However, Kidero argued the Senate has no authority to question how the county government utilizes local revenue. Here's Patrick Amimo opening our bulletin tonight to that report. And, uh, that Members of the Senate County Public Accounts and Investments Committee probed Nairobi Governor Evans Kidero and the county executive over the use of local revenue by the county government after the Auditor General raised a red flag. Auditor General Edward Ouko questioned the whereabouts of 10.3 billion shillings that the county government collected in local revenue but failed to transfer the cash to the county revenue fund account as required by law. The auditor says only 1 billion shillings out of the 11.4 billion shillings collected in the 2014-2015 financial year was deposited into the county bank account. The Auditor General also accused the county government of transferring 11.3 billion shillings from the exchequer to operational accounts in commercial banks without written approval of control of budget, contrary to the Public Finance and Management Act. There are two queries. One, auditors, the whereabout of this money, 10 billion, 333 million, 449,206, if an audit is required. Uh, of what the, how the 10 billion was spent and which orders it was made, then the, the uh, Senate can pronounce itself on that. But I still take you back to issue of jurisdiction. The Senate has no jurisdiction on locally generated revenue. It is the county assembly that has jurisdiction. The county assembly has queried this, a report has been done. Kidero accused the national government of defaulting on payment of land rates, parking fee, and other services provided by the county government. Kidero attributed the county government's poor delivery of services to the billions of shillings owed by the national government in local revenue. Someone, uh, CS and PS Treasury, to come and explain why they are not able to meet their commitments. While on the other hand, when KRA wants to get money from us, what they owe, they don't even ask us, they just go straight to bank, our bank account and attach it. If it can be made clear that uh, uh, national government won't pay, will not pay, then we know from the very beginning so that we can exclude such revenue from our projections and we adjust our ex expenditure budget accordingly. One on the army land in Embakasi where we are owed 61.5 billion. The second was the outstanding payments on rates and capex owed by the various ministries through um, treasury asylum. 